How you doing guys? Uh, today we're going to talk about um, Color Grading Central's new major upgrade to um, Color Finale 1.5 that uh, has some significant upgrades. Um, and for one, the one I've been waiting for, it now supports Color Checker Passport Video, and which are actually going to use to uh, color grade this uh, video itself. And uh, another neat thing it also has is um, LUT gallery and if you already have any LUTs within Final Color Finale um, you can pre-screen them without actually having to apply it separately which I'm going to show you here very shortly and which is very nice if you already own Color Finale this upgrade is free um, especially with the LUT gallery um, it was, uh, if you buy it separately it's actually a $49 value which you get free as well as the um, x right Color Checker Passport Video Support, also a free upgrade as well. So uh, good on uh, Denver Riddle. Appreciate the uh, free upgrade. How you doing guys? Uh, we're going to test out the new um, Color Finale 1.5 and some of the features. Um, and in this instant, we're, we're going to use the uh, Color Checker Passport Video from x right They finally included uh, that update in it which uh, I, I've been waiting for for a while so we're gonna go ahead and click on color finale and then uh, we're gonna go ahead and open up the control before that we do that I'm actually gonna zoom in 300 percent um, just so it'll be easier to see the color chart uh, and then here with the new um, passport support you're gonna click on the gear right here now uh, UCMS is a pro feature that they uh, I don't think they've uh, enabled yet or you have to pay for um, also you get a discount if you're a color finale user so we're gonna click on display uh, chart grid and then you simply start from one corner to the next you uh, must start on yellow first then you're gonna go to uh, green then white and then black then you'll see all your um, circles and make sure the circles are um, properly aligned in the center to get the uh, the best results now I also found this out um, you need to zoom back out hundred percent or the color is gonna get really bad so um, we're actually gonna fit it in just like so click on the match and there we go um, it is properly color corrected uh, very nice feature now all this does is give it get it to the the base color correction and from there you can tweak it as needed uh, also another new feature is the LUT gallery for version uh, 1.5 and uh, here I have all my LUTs right here so you simply click on LUT gallery and from here you can actually look at all your LUTs um, now here you got this numbered system so if you only have a couple then you can just choose um, two and the more that you have I actually got a whole lot so you can see them all at once and we're actually going to go ahead and select uh, let me see if I can find that here. Uh, my my favorite is probably the Osiris collection, and we're kind of trying to find that. Uh, in this case, a lot of times I use Vision Six, so you can click on it to see what the uh, LUT's going to look like. Um, actually, we may try another one. It's a bit bright. Of course, we can adjust it once we apply the LUT and and uh, let me try vision 4 okay it looks like uh, vision 6 is going to be good enough okay we're going to go ahead and apply that from there and we're just simply going to unclick the LUT gallery to get rid of it and I'm going to actually adjust the amount of 
um, LUTs for this right here. Right, there we go right there. So those are some of the new features of the Color Finale 1.5.